blame, mm -hmm. then it's easy to get done with the, with the mess. With, with all that's yeah. going on. All right, before we move away from this story, Nerima, uh, one of the things, obviously, that uh, has been poised or mentioned to be a div uh, divider of the nation is just the electoral process. What do you see as uh, you know, CEO of Siasa Place in terms of uh, the young people coming up to sort this out? Because it looks like... We just don't seem to be getting to the bottom of this. I think it's actual ownership of the electoral process because when we also compare election processes in other countries, it's ordinary citizens who are doing the counting mm -hmm. because they are more concerned of the the system being correct in the terms that the individual that you selected is the one who is actually going to be appointed and elected. Mm -hmm. And for us, we have trust within that, where we are aware that there are political processes, not just nationally, even within the county, that are skewed, where there was, uh, we've seen so many election processes having reruns now mm -hmm. in the county, mm -hmm. because there is evidence of lack of accountability on the ground when it comes to that. Right. And a lot of times you begin to see the real issue of not just voter bribery, but bribing officers to be able to skew results, to be able to support your agenda. So as soon as young people begin to realize that it's important to have the right leaders in place and it begins with them holding these leaders accountable at the ballot box, mm -hmm. not just voting but counting right. those votes. Because we have enough youth who can participate in this process, mm -hmm. who can count those votes. We have enough. And ensure that it's credible. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So okay. I think that's the system. That All right. Joe Halende, your last uh, comment on this. Actually, the problem now there's a group which is coming up with uh, some recommendation and they are and they are they are stating that the problem is about our electoral system which we are using first past the post the competitive nature of it don't we don't we have a, a way of bringing up something else that can at least quell this uh, competition and this tension in this country can we come up with uh, an idea and we see that we go that way can we use a full proportional system mm. yeah i think 